Hello, it's Friday 19th of June and you're watching Vulcan Forge News. This week, the full term 112 day Elysium Forges have been unlocked and rewards have been sent out. Many were waiting for their Elysium Forges to unlock, providing them with the funds for staking to level 5, dipping into the Rebel Cars marketplace and much more. Users can now, if they wish, lock their peer away again in an Elysium Forge. Probably the best way to earn lava. If you've got some Elysium peer and you'd like to lock it away, visit wallet.elysiumchain.tech and click on the Elysium Forges tab. We'll be sharing the link for more information as previously put out in our blog. In what has been a massive week here at Vulcan Forged, sowing for level 5 land in Vulcanverse has gone live. Sowing for level 5 staking went live on Tuesday 16th of July. If you hold Vulcan Forge land at level 4, you can sow now. Visit myforge.vulcanforge.com, go down to the staking tab, click on the tab for my lands and choose the plot you'd like to level up. You do need land to stake. Land staking will earn you peer, PYR. Visit blog.vulcanforge.com where you can read our latest article covering staking to level 5. Our Vulcan's Creed competition, put in place to celebrate lava earning going live last week, ended on Wednesday. Let's take a look at the final standings. Yes, the week-long Vulcan's Creed competition has ended. Looking at the top players for single player, we've got Too Easy for Sol, Blazblue, Tobitot704, Santix, they're all up there. Switching across to multiplayer, it's some of the same names again, Santix, Too Easy for Sol, Miss Catherine is in there also alongside Dextro Blaze. Keep it on our Discord, discord.gg forward slash Vulcan hyphen forged for the final leaderboards to be shared. We've had a few game updates and patches going live this week. Let's have a little glance. This week we've seen a huge Vulcanverse update, including level 5 Vulcanites. Chiron, Sharon, Copis, the Nemean Lion, Callisto the Bear are all now available in-game if you own the corresponding NFT. The Vulcanverse update also paves the way for raid bosses and some of the first professions. Alongside this, we've seen updates to Tower Defense and to Vulcan's Poker. As usual, you'll hear about all updates first on Discord, discord.gg forward slash Vulcan hyphen forged. Make sure you're over there, don't miss out. One of our most innovative and fun games is available on the MetaQuest through the App Lab. Let's take a look at Tartarus VR. Yes, as well as Tartarus being available on the PC through the Vulcan Studios launcher, you can play it on the MetaQuest. If you've got a headset, jump into the MetaQuest app and search for Tartarus on the App Lab. Here you'll be able to play the main game and some sub-games, including a fan favourite, Close Combat, where you can sweat it out taking on the demons as you protect the central crystal. Rebel cars are building on Elysium and in another first this week, their marketplace went live. Rebel cars recently went down a storm at Vulcan 4 where you could play the alpha demo. You can now grab your CGI crafted Rebel car and racetrack utility NFTs. Visit market.rebelcars.io forward slash store. And that's your lot for this week. Please follow, like and repost if you're over on X. And like and subscribe if you're watching us on YouTube. Until next week, forge on.